We're Seeker Creatures. We're on Denver Loft Sessions. Right here, right now. I think it was one of the first songs that we wrote together when I joined the band as the official kind of lead singer slash bass player, um, Leave Me Alone, where it was just kind of a groove. We were just playing a groove, going over it, and I walked up to the mic, started singing, and those words came out, leave me alone, a bunch of other words too, but leave me alone, kind of what stuck. Running away with nothing to say Not a thought about the love you thought you'd think you'd know Did you ever want to see me again? Found the place, place that you needed to go. Leave me alone.
My name is Angelica Proctor. Um, I'm from Brazil. I play keys and percussion, <laughs> and I sing. My name is Eric Proctor. I play drums and percussion, and I've lived all over, kind of, so I really consider home where the heart is, so right now that's Denver. My name is James Knox. I'm from Georgia, and I play the electric guitar. My name is Jay Berwick. Um, I'm from Vermont via Massachusetts, and uh, I play the bass. Play the bass, mom. Jeremy Wendelin, and I was born in Greeley, raised in Lakewood, and uh, basically been a Colorado guy all my life. Uh, and then I played saxophone. My name is Joe Zimmett. I'm from a little bit of everywhere. Uh, I was born in England. I came to the United States to go to the university, uh, and then I moved to Denver about eight years ago, and I played the trumpet. I will never forget, I was, later in life I had stopped playing drums for about two years. It was around that 16 year old college time to drive, or high school time to drive. And I was in college one night, I couldn't sleep and I put on an Incubus album and it just, it made me tear up and made me realize that that's what I wanted to do. It's just the, the lyrics spoke to me. We used to do a, a talent show in my high school and a group of us got together kind of out of nowhere. We did Roadhouse Blues by the Doors, and we did an auditorium of you know, about 800 people, and we had everyone on their feet by the end. And this is the high school talent show where no one stands up. It's just you know a bunch of whatever. So that moment, I was just, wow, this, I'm gonna do this forever. This is, yeah, this is my thing. But never been gold. I've fallen down on my face. I've gone toe to toe. You say you're running, but you just can't hide. I've been running from the wrong side. Why won't they let me let me see this through? It's never been wrong, but it's never been right. But it's always been true. It's gotta be love.
I do practice every day. It's not always with an instrument in my hand, but I definitely think about scales. Um, I do buzzing techniques. I think it's important for every musician, whether you're playing brass or strings, um, it's all muscle memory. And if you're not continuing to practice, you're not continuing to learn. And if you're not continuing to learn, you've plateaued. So always trying to get better, always learning. I've been around this world, there ain't nothing like this place The elevated moonlight, shining in my soul Feeling so mild in Colorado When you're at Red Rocks for a hike or a concert, did you know you can do your part to keep one of Denver's favorite parks clean? Friends of Red Rocks is a large volunteer organization that cleans up the park monthly and during shows. They do their cleanup thing on the last Saturday of each month and meet in the South Lot. Go online for more info. And remember, when you're at the Rocks this year, partying at Shakedown Street in the South Lot, or tossing a football and bumping the base in the North, please pick up after yourself. If you enjoy the arts, which are a big part of civic life, then stay informed on other civic things by watching award-winning local TV programs and city council meetings live and on demand every day on Denver 8 TV. Denver music fans know how lucky we are to have the world-class concert venue Red Rocks right in our backyard. This season's concert schedule is filling up fast, so check online for when your favorite artists will be playing. Many of the same production pros that bring you the Denver Loft Sessions also produce another great show on Denver 8 TV, Red Rocks Premieres. Go online for more information and schedules for both shows, and be sure to check us out on Facebook and YouTube. So whether you're enjoying your favorite music outside at the Rocks, or on your couch with Denver ATV. We'll keep you rocking all year long. We have these tones of reggae, and then we have these tones of like, almost like a, like a Latin kind of groove to it, and then we just go into straight like rock kind of grooves. So to kind of put it all together, I, I almost just consider reggae rock.
Other bands, they always have an idea, and you, oh wow, that's super cool. So, very good musicians. Coming from where I've been before, Denver's scene is amazing. Like I, I can't express the amount of musicians that you can come across, the amount of styles, and the level of musicianship is just bar none up here. It's just unbelievable. People seem to be coming here more too, and starting to flock here. Um, then even just seeing. Uh, bands that create other bands and then you have these other projects that are guests from other bands and all these other bands that are creating other bands and it's just it's amazing I've never experienced anything like that in all the other places I've lived. There's a lot of talent and, 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 and that, that's very obvious and I think there's, there's, there's good energy a lot of good people uh, I've met a lot of friends in the Denver music scene and, and that's been really fun for me.
in my car, I have sublime 40 ounces of freedom in the car right now. Other than that, I like to listen to comedy. It helps with the road rage. Hey, people gather around. I got something for you to see. Telling you it's good now. In the place that you've been for a long, long time. When you're at Red Rocks for a hike or a concert, did you know you can do your part to keep one of Denver's favorite parks clean? Friends of Red Rocks is a large volunteer organization that cleans up the park monthly and during shows. They do their cleanup thing on the last Saturday of each month and meet in the south lot. Go online for more info. And remember, when you're at the Rocks this year, partying at Shakedown Street in the south lot, or tossing a football and bumping the base in the north, please pick up after yourself. If you enjoy the arts, which are a big part of civic life, then stay informed on other civic things by watching award-winning local TV programs and city council meetings live and on demand every day on Denver 8 TV. Denver music fans know how lucky we are to have the world-class concert venue Red Rocks right in our backyard. This season's concert schedule is filling up fast, so check online for when your favorite artists will be playing. Many of the same production pros that bring you the Denver Loft Sessions also produce another great show on Denver 8 TV, Red Rocks Premieres. Go online for more information and schedules for both shows, and be sure to check us out on Facebook and YouTube. So whether you're enjoying your favorite music outside at The Rocks, or on your couch with Denver ATV, we'll keep you rocking all year long. People have told me maybe Jonah Hill. Well, which is an Apollo Rosio, which is a Brazilian um, actress, and uh, I think she's very beautiful. I always get that I look like Dale Earnhardt Jr. Um, back when I had shorter hair. Um, I don't know how him he's acting in commercials. Maybe he would play it. <laughs> Bradley Cooper. That's, that's me, right? I... Tom Cruise, clearly. <laughs> you know, I don't know that I have an answer for that. Kenny G. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, people gather round, I got something for you to see. Telling you it's good now, in the place that you've been for a long, long time. And somewhere else is another world, another people, another world for you to see. Cause this one's going up in smoke, you see. I know something more than this life that's ever been known. Somewhere deep down in your heart, you know it's gonna happen too. I know that you've been so wrong, but this time I'm right, I promise you. We're gonna be safe and sound. We're gonna be above the ground for today. But it's gonna be a better what I know. Something more than this life that's ever been known.
Dancers Hooli is one of the best Celtic bands on the front range, playing a blend of traditional Celtic with great classic rock around the edges. Don't miss the music and the fun of Chancers Hooli on the next Denver Loft Sessions.